Hello. Very exciting episode today. New character, beloved character, at the very least, extremely nice to look at. If you'd like to see the longer version of this conversation and other bonus content, check out my Patreon. I like to do this because it makes me feel like a wizard when I put in the text. My name is Ashley Clements. My name is Mary Kate Wiles. And this is The Look Back Diaries. Looking back, looking back, yeah. Looking straight back. In back. I probably should have warned them that you weren't Wes. I'm not Wes. I'm so sorry. But beautiful blonde. True. I thank you. My aunt. If I thought certainly... that through, I would have. I would have done a whole tease thing at the beginning. <laughs> I'm like, a right, you beautiful blonde. And then no one can be disappointed <laughs> because they love you and you're beautiful and you're blonde. So yeah. if anyone was disappointed, they would have to admit that they were the asshole. I mean. Nothing. <laughs> My abs cannot even begin to compete with Wes Adderall. Not a lot of people's can. I was going to say no one's can, but like basically it's like we're talking like Marvel superhero model. Not everyone has to have abs. I mean, you do. You want to be Wickham because we made That's all true. those boys show us their abs. We did. We did. Well, let's talk about thing. casting Wickham because that was a fun day. <laughs> As with all of our other characters, we had already established certain things about Wickham, and one of them was that he has very charming shoulders. And that he was a swimmer. Yeah. So I think the breakdown did say we were looking for a swimmer's body. I specifically remember, Laura, before we even had auditions, being like, my friend Wes is the one for this. And... She was right. What's crazy, because I found this in my email, you were not at the first auditions. We just had Wickham Reed with Lizzie. Yeah, Mm. which is so weird. But we also didn't know at this point that we were going to do the whole thing the way that we ended up doing it. So Exactly, exactly. So thank God we did do a Wickham Reed with you. But we, yeah, I came to the um, call back. Yes. So we did the initial auditions, which was just a scene with Lizzie and, and Wickham. So I don't remember which one. It might have been the early part of this episode that we're going to watch. Mm-hmm. And then in the callbacks, we did the part where you come in and throw water on him and he takes his shirt off. Yep. Sure did. And there were probably like eight of them or something. Yeah, I was going to say six. I don't remember. Yeah, I remember. Maybe six. But so we had these callbacks. They read with both of us and and we made all of them take their shirts off. I mean, to be fair, every single one of them just did it because it was in the script. And also yeah. like they knew they had goods to show off. Yeah. Uh, except for one person who did like ask hmm. and was like, do you want, want me to take my shirt off at that point? And literally like this is the appropriate response. Jenny Powell who says whatever you're comfortable with. But I have already said, yes, yes, we do. <laughs> like simultaneously. <laughs> because you, that's the appropriate answer. Like, <laughs> and because the role required it, we probably weren't going yeah. to cast the person who didn't take his shirt off. But like, it was a funny moment where I was very inappropriate. So inappropriate. And, realized, and then I was like, oops, yeah, yo, no, 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 no. <laughs> we left the room all agreeing it was Wes and part of that was because you had such strong feelings about I it I did feel very strongly I was like gotta be Wes I do appreciate throughout the process that they allowed us to give thoughts and feedback on some of the casting as the show went along and didn't shut us out of that process I do appreciate that yeah especially I feel like the three sisters had a say in our yeah. men mm-hmm. folk We did. Obviously, everyone had to approve, but I feel like there were times when we had strong preferences and Mm -hmm. that may have tipped the scales. Mm -hmm. And I appreciate that as well, because that is not an experience that actors very often get to have. No. But so you picked him. And Mm -hmm. shall we take a look at the episode? Let's do it. Let's look at handsome, handsome Wes. Handsome, handsome. Speaking of models. Yeah, truly. You, I mean, See, this is a moment where I think here. my hair looks good. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, you look great. You look very pretty. <laughs> a surprising moment for me. No. It must have been early in the morning, first of all. This is because <laughs> we got real sweaty. So, I mean, I'm it's clean. like I'm clear. Dry. It gives the vibe that Lizzie's like trying to look cute for this Absolutely. guy. Absolutely. Yeah, thank God we didn't do. Wes at the end of the day because yeah it would have just been a sticky sticky mess 
Yeah. I really enjoy the storybook convention. Like I found that really fun to do and I love when we revisit it later. Yeah. So Yeah, it's fun. But I'm getting ahead of myself. But it's just how it's spelled. <laughs> Hello. Yep, we wrote this in on purpose. <laughs> I just am thinking about when this episode came out and people being excited oh, and what a fun yeah, time that I mean, was. Indeed. Cause like we'd already given them beautiful Christopher Sean. Yeah. And then, but, but this is also, also, this is a very fun time when we flip the, the paradigm of the male gaze and this yeah. is just fully like, we are going to ogle yeah. this hot, hot man. <laughs> Attractive man. He really is just like, yeah, I don't know. He's so, so good for this part. <laughs> so, so pretty. Just seeing this, I'm like, also, how, did, yeah, how did we consider any other human for Wickham? Because and the comment, like, I think you and I both get defensive when the comments are just like hating George. And obviously we sure. know that that means they're invested in the story and that Wes yes. did a good job. But like, we love Wes. He's such a He's delightful yes. human being that yeah. we're like hey i mean okay fine it's but they hate him so much like i mean he really which like, also means they love lydia that's true but he's i don't know not to he's just immediately got the vibe that he should have which is like mm -hmm. you can tell he's kind of smarmy but you don't yep. care because he's but so he's handsome. so and he's yeah. very charming no he's extremely charming but like there are absolutely red flags. There are red flags in yeah. this episode. Like yeah. he's yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a little, um, you know, quick to anger when you spill water on his favorite plain yes. gray t-shirt. Favorite shirt. <laughs> I know. I mean, that's the thing. We're like, we did not provide wardrobe. So, like, what are we gonna say when we're like, oh, you're yeah. that's your favorite <laughs> shirt? No, but I feel like did we? Oh my god. <laughs> well, and also like this is one of those things where like. Yes, I do think that this was the audition scene for oh, the really? two of us. Yeah. But, like, that's one of those things where, like, that doesn't really see. And I love that, like, Lizzie even has a moment where she's like, okay, I'm not, like, into that. But then yeah. he's, yeah, yeah, he's yeah. just so hot you don't care. Like, we, <laughs> yeah. I said this in a previous episode, but, like, look, we all have had a George. <laughs> yeah. I mean, maybe you haven't and, and good for you. But I have definitely you know made some poor choices because of somebody's very, very beautiful appearance before. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But it also, uh, like, it is you see this and you're like this feels a little weird for lizzie but it he makes total sense for lydia like of course yes. lydia's into him exactly exactly like you're but, kind of confused that lizzie would because she's so smart and she's like you know come on lizzie but yeah like, no like i think it makes more sense when you see him and i yeah. think that we should have leaned more into that like yeah you know rather than sort of like Lizzie keep defending him as being like a gentleman and stuff it's like no, yes like he's yes. just really freaking hot like he's so yeah. hot that you're stupid about it that's yeah it. And, and like I've done that so I get it I'm like yeah no he's he's really hot yeah <laughs> it made the hormones go whoop whoop and it made the brain go <laughs> boop boop like I don't know. <laughs> um uh yes indeed Oh yeah, Darwin. But I forgot. But I found that I found that whole bit very enjoyable. So this shocked me when I realized this. What? This is the only time that you two appear together in the Lizzie Bennet diaries. Oh really? Oh well, yeah, I yeah. guess that's true. Isn't that weird though? <laughs> <laughs> I know the way you does that. I so throw right. that up. <laughs> very silly and also this is so smart like he clocks what's happening he's like yeah. oh okay i know what i've got <laughs> and i'll very much show it to the internet yeah and i'll yeah like it's oh also, boy uh, the peach thing is real gross can you believe i, oh, I, <laughs> I forgot about peach. Any of it. i don't know if you catch i don't know if it like it plays as much that i slap your hand away because it's funny it's very funny <laughs> The whole thing is funny. It's good and smart and funny. Yeah, very fun. And he's very hot and pretty, which is <laughs> which is really, I feel like, the point. But also, like, when this was first written, we hadn't cast him. So, yeah. uh, like, when all the other things kind of leading up to 
introducing Wickham, we didn't know what he, exactly what he was going to look like. Obviously, we knew we were going to cast somebody good looking. Handsome. Just the type of pretty that makes you go dumb dumb in the brain brain. <laughs> that's that's what he is. Also, I remember so many comments and that this was like a thing that sort of followed Wes around in his life as well. But he was like, I'm not wearing eyeliner. These are my eyes. Thank yes. you so much. I forgot about that, but you're so right. It's really just that like he's very thick eyelashes and they're like, very densely yeah. populated. So honestly, yeah. it's stupid. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like he'd be very hot in some guy liner. Like I'd be very into it. Yeah. But he doesn't need it because he basically already has. It. Yeah. 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 I'm so glad that I could just continue to objectify Wes as the show has as well. Sweet Wes. Sweet, sweet Wes. He bore it all. I mean, I guess if you look like that <laughs> and you've always looked like that, you just know. You don't <laughs> and you're with just some like, of it before. No, and I remember him yeah, handling yeah. it very well when yeah. like everyone kind of hated hate you know, hate yeah. hated George and you know, because yeah. the fans were very like <sighs> I guess it means that you're a good actor that I hate you so much. He also, I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but in, I mean, obviously we were all doing things and like going to cons and things, but I don't feel like he was quite as plugged into like no, the social no, media I think, and everything as like we were. Absolutely. No, I think that the four of us who were in all of it and also probably just you and I in general yeah. were probably the most plugged in. Yeah, I agree to that but I yeah I remember us kind of like being defensive about Wes but I as much as it's I a compliment for Wes that they hated him it's also like I think it's even more a testament to how much they love Lydia yeah I mean it's both right because he is really really awful in the <laughs> Lydia yeah. spinoff he's he's yeah. a, a real predator yeah and he does a good job of that he does a good job of being mm-hmm. that he did a great job we should not let him coach college students that <laughs> positions him to he's not great he's not great so yeah. we love him and we hate him and we're so glad that he was on our show yeah well let's see what the comments have to say about it because, let's see i mean if they're just not all about the abs and i don't want to hear them <laughs> claire hansen <laughs> no. says i can picture darching watch watching these and throwing popcorn at the screen Look, we're all very concerned about Darcy, but like we're here for the abs right now. Eve Black says it's kind of <laughs> ironic that Wickham is checking for red flags when he's the one giving off so many. He is, but why aren't we objectifying him more? <laughs> Anthony Parker Knight says, I love that some random gray t shirt is his favorite t shirt. LOL. That is a very True. good point. Oh, good point. Emily Serrano says, Wickham is like Hans. You love to hate him and you hate that you love him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. There's several of those. Yeah. Yeah. Nori Mori pointing out that he might be a mid-functioning sociopath. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, he's definitely he's definitely something not great, you know. Uh-huh. Um, yes. Thank you. Helpful. Coral Riviera Ocasio says, when he took off a shirt, I was like, no, brain, don't go there. He's Wickham. <laughs> this is what I want. I want. <laughs> Wait, great. Stephanie Mitchell says, my body is attracted to your body, but when you speak, my brain gets angry. <laughs> and. That about sums up my feelings on Wickham. That mm-hmm. from? That's funny. Mm-hmm. That's funny. Papercut 337 here with just great instincts says, I haven't read Pride and Prejudice, but for some reason I have a hunch that Wickham is secretly a giant tool. You just continue to listen to your gut, Papercut. You <laughs> have good instincts. I mean, so many people are just worried about Darcy right now. I love, oh no, he's hot. <laughs> when I'm going to look at these replies, what, they all are. It's a problem. If he wasn't, he'd never gotten away with all the crap he pulled. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Smoking hot. It's those ever so charming shoulders. I mean, the, the shoulders are great, but it's, um, it's those abs. It's, it's the abs. <laughs> well, another episode. Thank you. Thank you for joining. And uh, see you later. Peach. Bye.